Welcome back to Inside the PGTI. We were in the beautiful city of Colombo in the first week of February 2014 for the second edition of the Standard Chartered Open. Jarad Kumar, who was overnight tied 7th, climbed to the top of the leaderboard on day 2 after shooting the day's joint best score of 64. Chirag's bogey-free round featured 7 birdies, 4 on the front 9 and 3 on the back. Nathan Pereira, the overnight leader, continued to enjoy his home conditions with a 3 under 68 that kept him in the joint lead. Shivram Shrishta, the winner of the 2013 Surya Nepal Masters, posted a 5 under 66 that pushed him up from overnight tied second to joint first. This time I think I play very good. I'm very hitting very well and good putting also and lock also. I, I think this tournament I play very good. I think. Local hopes Tangaraja and Navagaran kept pace with the leaders lying in sole 4th and 5th positions respectively. Rashid Khan made his move up the leaderboard owing to a brilliant 65 to be tied 6th alongside Rohana at 6 under. Gaurav Pratap Singh also catapulted into the top 10 with a day's best score of 64 for a tied 8th spot with veteran Shamim Khan and Mukesh Kumar. The cut was declared at 5 over 147 with 50 professionals and one amateur making it to the third round. Sri Lankan golf has come a long way in the last few years and one indication of that fact is the rise of promising golfers like N. Ranga. The only amateur to make the cut this week, Ranga is a part of a young crop of golfers in the country that are trying to make mark on the big stage. Uh, Having been a part of the national team for a while now, Ranga has had the opportunity to put his golfing skills to test in various golfing competitions. Sabah gila thi na, events pahalo ko ditera. Events Japan gila thi na, Malaysia, Singapore, Thailand, Pakistan, India, Bangladesh. Yawa ke ratolo ata gila thi na. Kega top ten na gila thi na. Aapi team match ke gila thi na Pakistan ne ge. Coming from a humble background, Ranga needed all the support he could get to make a foray into a niche sport like golf. With the advent of PGTI on the Lankan soil, players like Ranga have been given the perfect platform to rub shoulders with the best in the region. The third round also saw a simultaneous start for the pro am event with two amateurs paired with two professionals. Mithun Pereira continued his birdie blitz in the penultimate round, firing a 6 under 65 to take a two stroke lead, taking his overall score to 17 under 196. Rashid Khan followed his second round 65 with a dazzling 62 to jump another four positions up the leaderboard for a sole second spot. 
going into the final day. Rashid's card for the day featured two eagles and five birdies. Third position was occupied by Sri Lanka's M. Tangaraja at 13 under 200 with a 68 in the third round. Overnight joint leader Chirap Kumar had an off day on the greens which saw him slip down the leaderboard to the fifth position after a disappointing 2 over 73. Today was, was a tough day for me, uh, nothing, to, uh, nothing because of the conditions or anything but I just found it hard to read the greens today. Um, I played well, I'm not that unhappy you know, with the way I played but just that the score doesn't reflect the way I played so um, yeah I just didn't read the greens well today, hopefully tomorrow will be a better day. A score of 1 under 70 was not enough for Shivram Shrestha to stay at the top as he too slipped down three positions to the sole fourth spot on 12 under. Indian golf stalwarts Shamin Khan and Mukesh Kumar had a good day out as matching 68 saw them lie tied on 6th on 8 under. But with a gap of 9 strokes between them and the leader, their chances of bagging the title looked bleak. A thrilling final day is next in the final segment as we take you down memory lane with the man who put Sri Lanka on the golfing map.